dare to play. Okay, I'm sorry that I didn't have that in the other one. Now, brother went through this game. Uh, he's also doing a book learning. The link is going to be at the end of this video and at the beginning of the last video, just so that you know. And that's where we ended last time. Haven't done. That's done. So still, can, can, still have to still have to do that. Good. Now, in order to meet the last person, I must assume that you must call it to daytime. Ooh, phone. Hey there, Nancy Drew. Hi, Deirdre. Are you in Colorado by any chance? Yes, how did you know? Some friend of my dad's called me for a reference for you. And you gave him a good reference? Well, I told him the truth. That was very nice of you. Was it? By the way, don't make a habit of it. Okay, bye. Wait, hang on a sec. I might need some outside help with this case. <laughs> did you forget be that fun. I don't like you? No, but I know you're studying criminology, and maybe someday I could help you out. Oh, a non-specific promise with the word someday. Sounds too tempting to ignore. Yet, here I go! Yeah, well, let's start off with seeing, well... It's locked. Yeah, I need a car to get in the lab. Well, that's gonna be locked up tight. And of course, up. Can't you still have to do that. Open it, open it, open it, open it, open it. Now, let's see if he's up now. If it looks like I'm busy, that means I'm busy. What are you working on? It's immensely complicated. Get a postgrad in advanced math and electrical engineering, then I'll explain it to you. Put it in layman's terms. Fine. There's this shiny magic that lives in the power lines, and it's dangerous and sly like a fox. And I'm using math to trick it into leaving the power lines, without accidentally making everyone die. That sounds like you're working on the wireless transmission of electricity to me. If you want to put too fine a point on it, go ahead, stranger. Which brings me to my next point. Who am I? Please let the answer be something that justifies me kicking you out of my workspace. <laughs> I'm here on behalf of a new potential owner. Wrong. No, that's correct. No, I mean wrong answer for me. Not the answer I wanted to hear. Do you know why Ryan would want to hurt Nico? The police already asked the same thing. Well, what did you tell them? I said if I were to have killed Nico, It'd be because he stole my work. Whoa, hold on. It's just a for instance. Is it? Yes, that's because I think logically. I force myself to think from A to B to C and so on. Ryan is all over the place. For her, it's A to zucchini, to that thing from TV, to maybe <laughs> C, then onto some non sequitur. I don't trust anyone I can't explain. Did you see? I beat your high score. Yes. If fighting is sure to result in victory, then you must fight. Sun Tzu compels me to take you down. Prepare yourself, opponent. <laughs> Can you tell me a little bit about Gray? He always gives me an industrial-sized portion of the creeps. The only person who ever <laughs> liked Gray was Nico. And I think he just liked keeping Gray around to scare everyone away from his work. Did he try to scare you away from Nico's work? No. 
He tried to scare me away from my own work. What does that mean? He was Nico's heavy. I figured he'd leave once the police gave the all clear. Trust me, if he's still here, he's up to something. Your boss would be smart to get rid of him. What's so special about Tesla? If you have to ask that, you haven't done your research. I mean, to you, what brought you here? The work. I turned down Los Alamos in a tenure-track position to be here. Most people don't know this, but the majority of Tesla's work was confiscated by the FBI. Why? Could be he was designing weapons. Could be he had a breakthrough that threatened the energy magnates. Don't know. It's all been hidden. What matters is, there's a little bit still here. I always suspected Nico had some squirreled away, and I'd be able to find it. But either he didn't, or I couldn't. What was Nico working on before he died? There wasn't a name for it yet, officially. It was basically wireless energy transfer. That was helpful for you. So how about you tell me something about your boss? I'm sorry, I can't. Confidential. What are you doing? I want you to tell me what you know, but I can't tell if you're a pushover or not. Not. Ah, efficiency. One of the rare graces of a post manner society. So very quickly, I want to point something out. Um, he keeps everything in mind. Um, he tries to keep everything real and nice and neat. You said you were searching for Nico's work. Did you ever look in Nico's personal things? Of course I looked. Did you work directly with Nico? No one worked with Nico. We barely spoke to each other. That's the way he liked it. He practically lived in the lab. If he wanted to look at my work, he'd just root around in my hard drive. So he'd come in here when you were gone? No, he'd use the network. He'd just snoop in your files? That seems kind of annoying. Not kind of, entirely. It's unethical, and it allowed him to steal. Um, what do no, you remember the about the day uh, Nico died? More than I care to. I imagine. Did anything stick out? Yes, the police. It was weird. One of us killed Nico, and here they were, talking about a basketball game, like it was any other day. You said one of us. Why? Why not say someone? It's just an expression. It's not an expression I'm aware of. Don't be contrarian. It doesn't suit you. You mentioned Nico stealing your work. Can you prove that? No. You must be pretty upset about that. Say what you really want to say. Did the police know your feelings about Nico? What a peculiar question. Do you have a peculiar answer? I do, in fact, have a peculiar answer. I actually told the police the truth. A more interesting question is how is Ryan still a free woman? Why shouldn't she be? In this case, the smoking gun is a miswired Tesla coil that she built. Did you dislike Nico? Very much so. Would you go as far as to say you hated Nico? I would go that far and further. That guy was a jerk. That seems a little disrespectful considering... Does it? Am I supposed to pretend he's great now that he's dead? Lots of jerks <laughs> have died and he's one of them. He's a dead, brilliant, jerk, madman. The world would be much better off if he'd lived to share more of his intellect. But I selfishly am glad I'll never have to deal with him again. What do you think of Ellie? She hates me so much that she switched to the night shift. Come to think of it, she hates me so much I should actually feel a sense of accomplishment, which I now do. There it is. What did you do that she dislikes you so much? Why do you assume it was me? I took an educated guess. I did too. Still couldn't figure it out. But the fact remains, we are not besties, as she likes to say. We our worsties. Goodbye. See you later. What are you doing? 
Okay, well, that's not gonna go over well with him. So, just for the inf for your information, in case you don't know, um, this is your evidence bag. You can keep your evidence in here. Well, excuse me, you do keep your evidence in there. Can't check. Still have to do that. Still have to. Can't check that. Can't check that. Can't check that off yet. Can't. Can't check. Still. Still can't check that off yet. Still have to do that. Can't check that off oh, yet. Oh yeah. How do you meet Ryan? Hmm. Huh. Want to be some people? No. Yeah. Certainly. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's locked. Go in it's there. locked. Oh, it's that's locked. The same, that's the same um, look we already have on um, Nancy. Well, it sounds like the same look we have on Nancy through um, Secret of the Square of Hand. Okay, so that's binary if you don't know that. Um... Okay. Still have to do that. But we have the textbook. Oh. Hey, see, this is the problem when you. Oh, the textbook. Oh. I'm so sorry about that. Are we cool? Um, yes. <laughs>